Hey guys, Alisa here and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, please consider hitting that subscribe button. I would really appreciate your support. And if you are not new here, welcome back to my channel. Hey girl, hey boy, what's up? Thanks for supporting. I am picking up of where I left off last. I was supposed to show you all some Pennywise purchases and I did not. So I'm going to show you all that now. So it's just a few purchases that I have here and the first being this yoga block. I have wanted one of these yoga blocks for some time now um, in the exercises that I follow on YouTube that I used to follow for Car Carolyn Govan. I think I mentioned her in some vlogs back. She uses a yoga block. I used to use a book in place of that and it wasn't so effective. So I was really happy when I saw this. I will remember to leave the price on the screen somewhere because... I can't find the um the bill at this point so besides that i got this i don't know what this is called is it a loofah i don't know but i've had one of this previously and i bought this before the gloves that i showed you all in the previous vlog but having used the glove i really prefer a glove over this but i already bought it so there's nothing i can do about it i can give it away or something or just use it interchange this with the glove the next thing i got is my moisturizer which i thought it was worth mentioning <laughs> if you are a part of the natural hair community you can definitely um consider trying this moisturizer it's very thick and with natural hair you need most times more product than usual so that's why i like about this you get a bang for your buck so um yeah that's only kind of old but you get a lot for your money um yeah it smells great it's very moisturizing and very effective so definitely consider trying this if you have not tried it the next thing i got is a jade ruler so this is the first time i would be using something like this not something like this this first time i'll be using a jade ruler and the price is $32.95. This is what I saw natural Nisi using on her face to help with the puffiness, especially in the morning. And um, it was recommended that you can place this in the refrigerator for it to get cold before putting it on your skin. So if you have used a jade roller, let me know in the comments if it works, if it's beneficial. I already bought it so i mean if it doesn't work there's nothing i can do about that but really excited to try it and i'll let you all know how it works out for me and the last thing i got is this saint ives body wash so this is the pink lemon and mandarin orange exfoliating body wash and really impressed with this so i used this already along with my glove that i bought in super farm and this is the brand of the glove clean logic and these two together it's a game changer so if you can get this definitely try this out after using this these products my skin felt very soft and i smelled also great you all know for the thousand time i am in love with fruity smelling products so this to me smells heavenly and along with this glove yeah so i mean you can try it out with any glove that you have it could be from anywhere but i personally really love this one because other gloves that i have felt in the past i've never bought one but i felt them they were not as rough as this they were more on the smooth side and i prefer or um i can appreciate the fact that this is rough because it actually does what it is supposed to do and that is to exfoliate the skin so yeah this left my skin feeling extremely smooth and this was around 30 dollars um if i can recall and it was definitely worth buying so if you can check it out in super farm if you can't i guess you can use whatever you have and definitely give this one a try so that was all the purchases that I made in Pennywise because I really wasn't supposed to buy anything I ended up going in there with my sister and 
I ended up picking up something. But you know, March is supposed to be a no spend month, so I will do better next month. All right, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Yeah, please don't mind what you're seeing in my mirror, right? I am doing some cleaning, okay? I had to put that out there. All right, so I'll see you guys. So, this is an impromptu vlogging session i didn't come out to vlog but um me and my sister we have been looking for a juice extractor because you all know juicing has a lot of benefits so we came into iem we actually went to super quality they had one so we just came to see what iem had and they have the hamilton beach juice extractor so this is what we are going with we want to look for some um for some containers so when we juice we could put it into the like do it for a week or so and some other things so <laughs> so the clip that you all saw before i was in iem we went to look for a juice extractor like i mentioned and also for some things for our movie night which you will see later in this vlog so we just got back outside i'll show you all the things when I get home, it had too much music in there for me to finish vlogging, but yeah. Came back outside to put the things in the car, pressing the alarm, I'm, I'm hearing it, but the key is not working at all. Putting in the key into the trunk, turning it, is not opening, I see. <laughs> all right, so let me go and open the, um, the car from the driver's <laughs> side. Press the alarm again, I'm hearing it, it beeping. Going to put in the, <laughs> put the key into the, driver side so it is still not open so i i have a tell my sister i'm like what the hell is going on what is, <laughs> what is up with this car something tell me look at the car it's the wrong car right <laughs> but the car is looking exactly like our car so that's why a car thank god the owner didn't come and see me trying to open it because that would have looked so bad so bad clumsy me right and, and she here laughing all the while right she could have helped me tony could have helped me eh? <laughs> <laughs> all right so i will see you all when i get home to show you all the things only stories stories what is up with me and if the body what is called like a dream catcher yeah they have a dream catcher hanging from the the mirror and i that's what when i looked in and i saw that i was like that's not the car i just look around to make sure no <laughs> nobody was watching me and then i went to my car but the thing is i was here in the alarm because the cars right next to one another so that could happen to anybody okay right don't judge me so i'll see you when i get home all right so i'm back home and i'm gonna give you all a quick i am home before we start prepping for pizza night so this is the juicer that we went with and this is the hamilton beach 400 watt extractor and in uh, super quality we saw one for three not not for three sorry we saw a 300 watt juicer but i called my dad well he's familiar with those things and i asked him i asked him about the wattage what does that mean so he said the higher the watt the more powerful so that's why we ended up going with this one i can't remember the cost right now it's about six something but if you all want to know i will probably leave it in the description bar or you can just drop a comment and i'll respond all right and we also got these containers this is for when we choose our fruits we can store them in these glass containers we got four of these and this was 25 dollars yeah we were out there spending money right i'm not sure how much fruits we'll have to juice to fill just one of this but we'll see and i'll definitely show you all when we take it out and start to use it hopefully tomorrow morning i'll show you all how it works and yeah just how everything turns out the next thing we got with these trays 
and this is a plastic tray $15 they had the hard plastic trays and it had from $35 and up but we went for the cheaper option because this is not something that we really need but I wanted the the cinema experience with the trays and you know that kind of thing so i really wanted to get a tray so i was happy when i saw these for 15 dollars and i bought four and i also bought some mittens pot holders and this was 25 or 35 dollars for a tricky set and we really needed this i was looking for them christmas time and i couldn't find any so we bought this i hope it's thick enough you know some of them sometimes they are very thin and they still burn your hand well when you hold something it burns your hand so yeah i like the price so that's why i got that and the last thing we got from i am just a minute i'm using one hand like that last thing we got is this pizza pan and this was 135 but this is it's heavy it actually has some weight to it and we don't have a pizza pan at the moment well we didn't have one we had the normal baking pans like the rectangular ones the square ones and I really wanted to get one of these for the longest and this is easy to clean non-stick and dishwasher safe we don't have a dishwasher but I'm just saying what it says and I think this would be this is very durable and would last a long time so yeah it had some smaller ones for about $60 but normally this is the size of the pizzas that we make at home so it didn't make sense buying the smaller one so yeah that was the only things that we got from IEM so I'm going to start prepping for pizza night now. So, y'all will see me soon. I don't understand why you're thinking of. You had me at a low This is the finished pizza we have a mixer you all saw how much meat i put on it and this is what i wanted to show you guys my sister got this in a store on on um uh, on park street so i will show you all how i put together everything uh, excited much mm. So unfortunately, I did not film myself putting the trays together, but as you all can see, it turned out great. It was really giving cinema vibes, you know? Hey y'all, what's up? I'm in my favorite place also it seems because you'll always see me in the car but we're heading out to get some ingredients to do some juicing which I've been putting off for doing for quite some time so yeah we just I have some fruits already but I want to get like some spinach and kale and I'll show you all how that works out because I don't know about juicing but we're gonna try it out and hopefully it tastes okay yeah i didn't even tell you all how the movie night turned out it was great 
we enjoyed it can't wait to do it again and we are going to do a games night next say hey hello <laughs> Conservative. Um, mommy said, "Mommy said like she wants some pizza. Pizza? Mm -hmm. True. So she said we we start with the pizza thing. Then, so like, when she wants, she want pizza from anymore? Huh? Yeah, we all go buy um. Let's call them pizza boy. Pizza boy. Is it about pizza boys? Yeah, it's still about pizza. See boys, if it have yeah. a um a number for pizza boys anymore and all that. Yeah, like I was saying before, I was interrupted. The movie night turned out really nice i don't know why we never did something like that as a family but um that's one of my goals to just make more time for family so i'm going to try to come up with different things that we can do outings things at home and even my nephew enjoyed it he stayed up it was a late night movie we finished watching the movie after 12 i was this close to sleeping but I made it through. Um, another movie is coming out by Madea, and not everybody likes watching Madea, but my mother enjoys the Madea movies, so probably when that next one comes out, we will do another movie night. So, on our way to the mall, to the mall, to True Value, like I mentioned, and mommy decided she wanted pizza, so gonna get that as well. Okay. And um, oh, but some of you or persons who you all who followed me on Instagram would have seen some pics or a photo shoot that I did. anything because I was waiting on the owner of the brand to do his post and I'll probably include probably a clip with me speaking to him the clip wasn't recorded properly though so the volume is very low December here and it's a promotion for Black Friday as well as we're doing the reveal for the new kits as well. Alright? Okay. See you next time. Right. So basically his name is Jamal Joseph. I can't remember his exact age and I don't want to say it wrong but he's around 23 or 24 very young and um yeah I just like what he's doing he's so young and you know out here doing his thing has his own brand so he'll definitely go and show him some love and support on his Instagram and also purchase something yeah. so the brand is player player and he has like sweatpants and t-shirts bathing suits I think don't put me on that but it's basically a clothing brand so you all could go ahead and check it out and I love to see my young black brothers and sisters doing it they show some support to jamal and his brand play up with I scarfed down my pizza because I didn't even realize that I didn't eat for the day so I was hungry so I ate that and I have a whole bunch of fruits so we're going to try the juicing now I am going to put things together that I think would taste good together or I'll look on Pinterest for some recipes but more than likely I will be looking on Pinterest because I don't know this juicing thing is new to me and I want it to at least taste good so that I can continue to do it. So I'll show you all the ingredients that I got in a little while holding a camera like this is so uncomfortable. It's heavy. But yeah, I'll show you all the fruits that I got in a little while. So we healthy all 
February. Yeah, me February all twenty twenty two, not just February. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. All right. So these are the ingredients that I got. This is kale. I didn't need for no kale. It was so expensive. I paid about twenty three dollars for this bunch, and it probably looks a lot, um like a lot on camera, but it isn't. I got pineapple, a small pineapple. Again, it looks big on camera but it's not we have a lot of apples home since Christmas um, we've been buying a lot of apples so we had that from before I bought watermelon over the weekend and some oranges that I have to peel cucumber ginger and a lime I oh and a beetroot so I think that's all the ingredients I think so that I have you know mango is in season so I would like to do one with mango but I don't have any right now and I'm not gonna buy it so I'll wait until I get some Julie mango to include that in one of my juices so yeah this would be working with a lot of ingredients hope that it tastes good so I'm gonna cut up the fruits that I have now and then use the recipes that I just got on pinterest very simple recipes and pray to god that it tastes good okay so let go this is the end product of the juicing four bottles we had a little extra of the watermelon recipe but i'll leave the um all the ingredients on the screen for both recipes and juicing is not for the week okay this is very time consuming and very messy so some more please go out and let you all know how they taste okay so i'm here busy but i have to come on to let you all know how this didn't expect it to taste this good, but mm. and I'm definitely tasting the ginger. There's a little zing to the drink, and the carrots. I'm tasting everything, but mainly the carrots. Mm -hmm. So your girl is gonna be juicing from now on. The I'm not so enthusiastic about this and the one with watermelon and kale, but I'll let you all know how that is as well. Happy Valentine's or happy Valentine's Day, whichever one you're celebrating. So my skin is wet right now. I'm sure y'all are seeing that. That's just because I just got out of the bathroom. I'm going out on a date. I don't really say that, but yeah, I'm going out and um what 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 i have like half an hour as usual i'm running late i have two options so yes i'll show you all that in the next clip and i'm just going to well my hair is combed already so it's probably just to neaten it up wherever it needs to be neatened up and do my eyebrows put on some very light makeup and that's it it is a really cool casual date that i'm going on so no fuss so yeah, let me go ahead and do what I am supposed to be doing. And uh, this is the foundation that I use. If I've never shown you all, this is the Matte and Poreless Foundation by Fit Me. And this is in the color Toffee Caramel. So I'm just going to put on some moisturizer. The Laneige, Laneige, Laneige 
water sleeping mask but this hydrates really good so i need to have a barrier between the foundation and my skin so i'm putting some of this on and some setting spray i'll just pat in to try to reduce some shine and yeah that's basically it so i'll show you all what i wear um jewelry bag whatever so yeah bye Lego. i have two options the first one you all won't be able to see this just like this it's a romper a long romper it has a deep cut in the front and it's a wide leg so i will have to show you all by trying it on and the next option is this um this is more of a bell spans this was in a fashion overhaul a long time ago yeah i've worn it probably about twice so i have this bodysuit that i want to wear with it or i have a black bodysuit so it's between these two things i had a dream i got everything i wanted not what you think and if i'm being honest it might have been a nightmare y'all he's here and this is how i'm looking i gotta go all right i'm back home and this is the outfit i ended up going with and i was hustling if you want to vlog and you want to go out a word to the wise start earlier okay so yeah i ended up running late so i didn't get to show you all what i chose before i left but um we went to imax and we saw death on the nile it was okay started off kind of slow for my liking but it ended nice i didn't show you all the jacket but obviously i had to carry a jacket because i would have been cold the sanders is from francis fashion and well i showed you all the chain the earrings watch so very simple so let me show you all it without the jacket so you can see how cute i look and i will include some photos that i took in imax yeah so this is the outfit without the jacket i think it turned out very cute i love the pants and this bodysuit together and if i didn't mention i can't remember if i did in the previous clip this bodysuit is from francis fashion the pants is fashion over and my sandals is from francis fashion so it is after 11 in the night now and sis is tired i've been going all day so i had work and then um a movie so that was my valentine's day nothing spectacular but i enjoyed it so i'll see you guys tomorrow please god and yeah peace hey this vlog is going to be so choppy but it's the morning well not the morning the afternoon after our nationwide blackout in trinidad what did you do where were you how did you get through it i mean it wasn't bad for me i was in work when it happened and um we left early and no lie i traveled i took a maxi and i reached home in about 15 minutes and that's something that never happens but i was so glad i just wanted to get out of bullet spain in case any craziness started to happen but um when i got home how was it the place wasn't too hot or anything i just took a bath and basically relaxed i was like you know what this is god saying we need to chill out and relax a little more so here yeah, hold this so that's exactly what i did took a bath ate something and what did i do and i um, started reading a book by td jakes instinct that helped me to doze off but i was in and out of sleep because you know when you have to sleep and the place is kind of just still and humid it's really difficult to just sleep through 
and my dog she was scared of the dark so she kept coming and waking me up and then my nephew was up talking my mother was up talking so i was just hearing things in between sleep and wake and i went off for a little sat on the sat down on a chair on the lawn just enjoy the fresh air but that's basically it i didn't do too much and unfortunately my phone didn't have charge so i couldn't even film anything i did have some light from my mirror so if i did have charge on my phone i could have you know documented a little of how the evening went for me but unfortunately i didn't and i took that as another sign to chill out and just be in the moment be present and yeah just enjoy it enjoy the little break from everything so yeah let me know down below how things worked out for y'all where you were when it happened and if you did use it as a time to just rest and reset well i know i told y'all about letting y'all know how the watermelon drink tasted the juice that i made but i haven't drank it as yet so i'll probably do that tomorrow so i'll ensure to pick up my camera and let you all know how it tasted but yeah that's it for now that's it like i mentioned this job this vlog is going to be so choppy but you will get little pieces of my week so i hope you all enjoy it i just came out to any pharmacy to go in the pharmacy and in the bank so let me show you all what i went to the pharmacy for this just in case anyone is looking for this because this was out of stock for a while i'm showing you all the wrong side african sea coconut i was looking for this all over everywhere that i went every pharmacy they told me it was out of stock so i got this and i paid 38.95 so if you're looking for this african sea coconut is something good to keep in your home definitely um let me know down below and i'll let you know where i got this all right so that's enough talking i'll see you all later